Last year's national championship trophy in hand, the 2010 Bearcats set out to recapture and defend the recent title. With many of the key players from last year's squad returning, the Cats were named the consensus preseason number one. I sat down with head coach Mel Churchma to talk about the preparation for this year's title defense. We approach it, this is a new year, uh, 2010 team has to create their own identity. Um, this is their year. We've got 20 seniors. They're excited about what their, you know, what their contribution to Bearcat football is really going to be because this is, this is, this is their year. And so uh, uh, it, it starts over every year. Churchman also talked about how he and his players handle the preseason hype. They know that all that's based on what happened last year, really. And uh, they, everything that <clears throat> this year is about is still in front of us. And they, and everything that's going to happen this year still has to be done. And so uh, uh, I don't, I don't look at that as a, you know as a challenge at all to get our kids ready. Uh, they they know that uh, uh, they're a target. Uh, there's a big target on them. Uh, we face that every year, but uh, they do a good job in preparing and, uh, like I said, establishing what this team's all about. The Cats dropped their season opener to Texas A&M Kingsville 16-7 for their fourth consecutive season opening loss. The Cats are not the only championship team in town as the Maryville Spoofhounds claimed the Class 2 title last year and aimed to repeat last year's success with hopes of winning the Class 3 title. The Hounds are off to a 1-1 one -one start opening the season with a road loss at Lawson, but recently shut out Smithville at home to begin conference play. With the Northwest Missourian, I'm Tony Botts.